what's going on everybody rob here aka trev 2323 and he wants to be on the video too say hi okay so i'm doing a video about this ring doorbell actually mine's is almost unscrewed right now but i actually drilled through this is hard wired in this is where the doorbell was okay this is where the doorbell was right here and i drilled through right here and drilled through so this ring doorbell is actually hardwired in let me see if i get this loose okay there's screws at the bottom that you got to unscrew hold on hold on good Douglas. and they they come off let me get it off real fast all right see there's screws at the bottom that you got to unscrew now this is the positive and negative that charges the ring doorbell okay so you could put it on like this and then you push down and then you tighten up the screws now let me tell you this about before i tighten it up this right here see this right here this is a charger to charge your ring doorbell right here okay so why i'm doing this video about this ring doorbell is because it's been really cold in chicago in the shy town and there's other people that buy these ring doorbells like this and they they charge them they say well you could charge it at home and yes you can charge your ring doorbell but if you don't have these you have to keep charging it and also something's coming and also if you don't have those you, you got to keep charging it <gasps> let me go back here and finish okay so now i'm inside so people's not passing by so i could talk okay so now with the ring doorbell they have it where you can recharge it okay so i showed you how to put it on put it off i cut my wires drilled through my bricks so it's constantly charging now there's a battery in there. there's a lithium phosphate lithium ion battery in there okay so in the summertime if you charge it the charge will last a long time now i have it connected to the house doorbell that little bit of trickle power from the doorbell it keeps it all summer long and even when it's cold outside it's 41 degrees right now but if it drops in the teens that doorbell I would have to charge a lot more. I have to take it off and bring it inside to charge inside with the uh, phone charger in the outlet because in the extreme cold, it will not stay charged. So when people are buying these ring doorbells, they're buying them and they're they're thinking it's going to be easy to charge it and put it out there, charge it and put it out there, just keep charging and put And it does become a pain in the butt if it's not hardwired in there. Like I said, in the summertime, we don't got to touch it. It just stays charged all the time. And in the wintertime, sometimes like in the 40s, we don't got to touch it. It's fine. But it dropped into the 30s this past week or the 20s at nighttime. And then it alerted us on the phone saying that your ring doorbell no, does need to be charged. So I had to take it off and bring it inside. It warmed up. And then I had to leave it fully charged and then put it back out there. Okay, so that's why other than that, other than that ring doorbell, I do got the Zosi cameras up there. And those are 12-volt uh, cameras hooked up into the system. And those ones are on 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. It's a Zosi brand. Check out Trev2323 Zosi. I talk about them. I got the 4K ones now. But this is about the ring doorbell. But I do like it. We do like it because you could talk through it. You could uh, see everything that's going on. Uh, you could snooze it also. So it'll still record when it gets motion. But you could snooze it so it won't be on your phone. Because a lot of people say, man, and I got these doorbells. But it's just constantly going off on my phone. Well, you could hit snooze for a couple hours or whatever. And it'll you could snooze the doorbell where it will still record. Now, another thing with the ADT cameras. I got somebody with the ADT cameras that I know. And I I didn't have, know you had to pay per frame or per snapshot so that's going to be another thing i'm gonna have to go into but this was about the ring doorbell if you're buying the ring doorbell do realize it does need power so you're going to need to keep taking it off to bring it into charge or they got the little solar chargers around it also but in the summertime the solar charges are okay but in the winter time man this cold winter in chicago drains that battery where even if it's hardwired in i gotta bring it in sometimes to recharge talk to you later subscribe like and share